Chef Colin, how's it? Ben, good to see you. Good to see you. Let's start cooking, man. What are we okay. doing? Okay, this is what we're gonna do today. We're gonna take some mahi and we're gonna bread this thing. So I'm gonna show you. Oh, the mahi this. looks good, yeah? Mahi is very nice this time of year. It's running very well. Slightly salt and pepper. Okay. We're gonna do both sides. And then we're gonna dredge it in a little flour. And what I have here is some just basic store-bought tempura batter. Okay, gotcha. Nothing fancy, just right out of the box. What I did was I just dredged it, put it in some tempura batter, and I put it in this bubu arare. And what we'll do is we'll coat it with this stuff. Okay. So it's kind of like a arare mahi-mahi. So, but what we're gonna do with this, we just deep fry this. Right into the fryer, 350 degrees. And you're gonna watch it just puff up. Okay. We're gonna saute some peas. Mushroom. Ooh, fish is looking good. It's starting to float. Getting close. We're close. We're very close. We're gonna add a little butter in there. Oh, I'm sorry. Is sorry. this the one? Oh, yes. Thanks. I, sh I should stop oh, yeah. moving things around. Sorry. <laughs> Okay. What's that, garlic butter though, huh? We have a little seasoned um, herb butter. Herb butter. It has some garlic, herbs, and a um, little bit of chives in it. So we're going to mix some of that in. A little bit of white wine. Oh, it looks good, looks good. Give this a quick saute and... That would be a great vegetable bed for all kinds of dishes, huh? Yes. And our mahi is just about there. Ooh, looking good. So as you look at it, you can see all the bubu arare on it. Interesting, nice yeah, it crispy. hasn't changed color. I mean, this is yeah. the stuff we started with. Mm -hmm. It's exactly the same. Yeah. It's a little bit browner. I would have thought it would have gotten browner. But it's crispier. Now it's really crispy, it's crunchy, so. Nice bed in the middle. Man. And then we'll put our, our bubu arare on it. Today I'm going to be using a kabayaki butter sauce that I made a little bit earlier today. Mm -hmm. it's What's a, a kabayaki? Kabayaki is just a basic shoyu sugar. It's a reduction with some eel juice and some other good stuff in it. Wow, that looks great. Then what we'll do is we'll just garnish it a little bit with some kaiwari sprouts and some pickle ginger. Horseradish sprouts, huh? Yeah. With pickle ginger? And then what oh, we'll nice do, color. Yeah, make a nice ball of this. And that's the dish. Right? And this is called? This is our Bubu Mahi Mahi. Awesome. Bubu Mahi Mahi by Chef Colin. Colin, I'll tell you what, it looks real good. We're really not sure if it tastes real good. So Let's we're going to take try. a break right now, and we'll be right back to see if this does taste as good as it looks. All right. Awesome job, man. Thanks. Right on. Well, we're back with Chef Colin Nishida from Side Street Bar and Grill. And Chef, awesome Great. job as usual. Tell Thanks. us again what you just made and describe that for us. This is our bubu arare mahi mahi. Uh huh. On a bed of shiitake mushrooms and snow peas. Let's uh, let's both have a piece, guy, right. and let's I'll tell everybody what I think of this one. Never having had bubu arare on my mahi mahi. Ooh, that sauce looks really good. Let's try that. Okay. Okay. How's it taste? Oh, I can't get it. Chef, this is so good. This is so good. You know, the, as they described the mouth feel, you know, from that bubu and mm -hmm. It's great, the fish crunch. is nice and moist. Yeah. That butter yaki sauce is terrific. Good job, sir. Thank you, Ben. We want to say thank you to the chef for being on the show. Thank you to all the fishermen who are on the show. And folks, it's only going to be about a week, and we'll be back, and we'll see you on Let's Go Fishing.